morning. Well, it's right at 7 o'clock. Time to head on out. About an hour behind where I wanted to be. Oh well. Here's what it is. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. All my friends over in Ohio and Indiana at the Gold Rush Days from the GPS station, Gold Prospector Space. Hello, how you doing? I know you all are digging for gold. Well, we have got a beautiful day in Juneau, Alaska. A little bit of clouds just to take, keep the sun off of us. And we got a nice group of people out here today, by golly. Everybody's just about got running hydroforce nozzles into sluice boxes. Uh, we got uh, uh, Steve and Rob over there. They usually work down there at Howard's over there. Then we got uh, Marcello with the monster hog sitting up right there. He's running his. I got my dredge all up here with a four inch uh, hydroforce. Uh, you see that red band right across there? There's some of these layers that are thicker than that, but that's also just about where a lot of the color bands are coming in. Just above them and just below them into the next layer. Uh, and these guys here, they're uh, running their little uh, operation. It's kind of cool. Uh, fun times. Let's take a look at the box. Seems to be running really smooth. Processing a lot of sand. Um, we're running the, trying to run the Yukon. I'm going to give the Yukon that a run. See how it turns out. You can almost see how the water's fairly cleared out. But it's pretty heavy right through there. So. Looking good. Set at about 9 degrees angle. <coughs> and it's in the self-feeding monster mode. Let's go take a look at the monster hog while that thing's feeding away. Oh, Doc has been wanting to see the monster hog running. Look at there. There's the monster hog running. AKA Dominator. Oh, the Dominator. Hard times, man. Hard times leads to gold mining. <laughs> and every time the tide comes in it fills these holes pretty much right back up again unless you were there just the night before look at there getting the money getting the money cool so I'm here and I'm ready to help you. All right, I better get back to my hole. Well, we ran out of gas. Let's take a look at the map. Here's my tailings delta. What do we see? Do we see anything? Well, there's a lead shot. Did you get some? I'm looking. Oh. Okay. To let you know before you shut down all the way we'll run clear water and it'll wash all the dirt out some of the dirt out it'll make it easier where you can see it better and a little bit of lead so i guess that's a somewhere i was on some heavy material yeah all right i guess we'll reload and fire back up oh i'm about to say you better Huh? You better fire back up, brother. I'm gonna. Hey, everybody. Yeah, the fishermen folks all showed up. Just ran out of water. It's 11, ran out of gas again. It's 11.30. And we're running. Now, I had to cut about four feet off of it. I probably could stand to lose another two feet at least. It was just too much pressure for it to push up. So, building a little bit of a hole. Not near the size these guys are doing. But, you know, they got different guys cutting and grinding. And uh, they just ran out of water, too. You see any color? Uh, we didn't get to see it. You didn't get to see it? No, he ran out. 
Oh. We ran out of fuel. We didn't get the boxes box. box. It's, it's all red, though. Yeah. But I think we dominated the day, though. Yeah, we're all going to see tonight, ain't we? Yeah, we dominated this day. You know. You look at our hole. Look at the dominator hole. You know. So you got talent all the way down. Last piece is just you are. Huh. Well, you just got a couple rocks in there to bust it up a little bit. Slow it down. Slow it down. Slowing it down. I need one more. It looks like they're just now getting their water up too, so they're all running. Oh yeah, we're rocking a hole here. Hole. That's the hole you ran yesterday? Yep, last night. Last night. We're, we're, we're nice crew. We're done at 12 30, 1 o'clock. Cool. And let's see. Let's go look at long time. Look at the long time. Oh, yeah. He's running the dirt. Now, you added Yukon to this one, too? You added Yukon to this as well? Hey, you put Yukon in this as well, Russ? It's all Yukon all the way down to there, huh? Right where the ripples are? Yeah. Now, is that cut river hog or is that just... River hog and talon. R river hog and talon. Okay, bang, bang, bang. And what about your header box here? Quite a bit of the red red areas too, aren't you? Right on. Shedding. Boy, everybody been out here fishing, and we ain't seen a single fish caught yet today. We ain't seen a single fish. Yeah, we better get back to my box. It's feeding material. It's self-feeding right now. So it's coming around long. Look at there! Awesome! Right on! <laughs> Good job! First one I've seen caught out here in a while. Yeah, I don't know how good it's going to come out, but nice gold. few lines. Hey, we'll let the concrete up in here and take it home and see how it looks. Cool. Tides almost beat me out of the water. Okay, and there's my concentrates for the day. That's what come out of the new dredge. The new hydro force system. Oh yeah, yeah. He says his, his his next one, he moved a lot more material than I did. And here's what mine looks like. A lot of black sand in that. Hmm. <laughs> well, here's the hard times. Now, granted, his hole was three times as big as mine. Four. Four times as big as mine. 
Man, look at that golden net, son of a bitch. Wow. Wow. Cool. <laughs> okay. And here's his. I'm going to go ahead and needle magnet this up. At least some of the very top stuff. Sixty-three grains. That's all I got today. Sixty-three grains. I'll figure out how many grams that is here in a minute. I think that's four grams. Okay, and this one right here, this run right here is Marcello's, that hole that was behind his hole that I showed earlier. And this one here, I don't know, it was yesterday's day's run, and it ain't shit. It's about like what I had. Three hours shorter. Yeah. Oh, golden, golden sands. Hard times. These are hard times, man. We're so damn broke, we gotta go dig deep. <laughs> Our dirt's got gold in it. All right, well, my cello kicked my butt today in a big, big way. He, he did like four grand, or four times the hole, and he's got 350... Actually, it's 350 grains, even. Wow. <laughs> Dude. Gold. Okay, and his uh, yesterday's run, or last night's run, in that hole that I showed in the video, this one is 173.8. 173.8. Which came out to 11.2 grams. Okay, and this one here, the day before day yesterday, was about my clean out, about the size of my clean out, but he said it was a way smaller run, 